And there they go. Hot possibilities out for the lead. Star managers up close, so too is Tijuana Flair. Miss Ross from the rail. Far outside is Alexocrat. Double dot is the last of six. And big long shot hot possibility makes the pace. The favorite star manager is right there. So too is Miss Ross right off the leader's heels. And also up close to the action in the clear is Tijuana Flair with the green silks. Alexocrat comes away running in fifth. And Double Dot is content to be the last of six. And she's about five lengths off the pace. Hot possibility star manager and Tijuana Flair three across the track. It's a break of two and a half lengths to Miss Ross, flanked by Alexa Kratt. Double Dot tries to get involved with the wide run. Three by three up the back stretch, 24 and two fifths. Star manager and Tijuana Flair pick up the running. Hot possibilities back to third. Miss Ross, Double Dot, and Alexa Kratt are joining her. And it's a very compact group. About two and a half lengths covers the six pack. 49 and one fifth. Star manager, Tijuana Flair, one, two, heading into the turn. Double Dot is third. Then Alexa Gratimus Ross and Hot Possibilities at the back. And Star Manager has her head in front midway through the turn. Tijuana Flair stays with her. Double Dot is third, two and a half to find at the quarter pole. Miss Ross vying for fourth with Alexa Krat. And Hot Possibility, who led earlier, is now the trailer. And they turn for home. And Tijuana Flair is trying to get the lead from Star Manager. And they're hooked up in a big time battle at the 316. Star Manager and Tijuana Flair side by side. What a race to start the Tuesday card. Tijuana Flair has her nose in front. Now she's edging Claire. Tijuana Flair, Star Manager right back at her. Tijuana Flair, Tijuana Flair. Tijuana Flair in the opener. Give her two in a row. Senior in 2021 at Finger Lakes. 5416, the top four finishers. That exact to $47. The trifecta, $18. The dollar superfecta, $214 even. Second race will start the early pick four. Scratch one. And there they go. Bellagio off a little slowly, then squeeze shortly after the start. Blood Moons hustled away from the inside. Royal Suspect is engaging him. High Command's up close from third. Then our caravan, Kingfish. This cat can fly from the inside, and Bellagio is the last of all. And Royal Suspect is crossing over to make the pace. In second, Blood Moon, who concedes the lead and wants to switch into the two path. Our caravan gets to the rail, and he's three lengths off the pace, more than a length and a quarter in front of High Command. It's another length and a half to Kingfish, who races with this cat, can fly about six lengths to Bellagio, who's the last of all, and it's a 24 and one opening quarter. Royal Suspect and John Barrios, two and a half for three lengths to Blood Moon, another length and a half to Our Caravan. It's a length to High Command, who's in the fourth spot. Nearly two and a half to Kingfish, who races outside of this cat can fly. About seven lengths to Bellagio at the back. They're pretty strung out. 48 and one fifth. Royal Suspect, he's 60 to one, and he leads heading into the turn by six lengths from Blood Moon and Our Caravan, and they are closing in, especially Our Caravan. This old timer just loves to win races. I command his fourth. I'm going to Kingfish. This cat can fly in Bellagio. Royal Suspect with the lead, but he's on borrowed time because here comes Our Caravan to the outside. Our Caravan looking for his 27th career victory. He is making his move. Still Royal Suspect with something left. Our Caravan being tested this afternoon. In third race is Kingfish. Our Caravan, old man strength. He just loves to win races. Give him a high five. What a racehorse. Our Caravan. 7436 top four finishers the early double 57 the winning combination 50 and there they go from the outside gray invasion is sent to the lead will you win sums up close with curlin's night interstate and operative vie for fourth the big gray a late runner is the early trailer gray invasion from the outside looking to cross over and make the pace mission accomplished from curlin's night will you win some is third Interstate still vying for fourth with operative, and the big gray is about six lengths behind Gray Invasion. Gray Invasion, 24 and two fifths, making the pace to the back stretch from the outside. Still hasn't able to cross over. Where is he? Looks like he's three deep near the five eighths. From between runners is will you win some? And Curlin's Knight holds his spot from the rail. Break of more than three lengths to operative, who races with Interstate. 
And the Big Gray wants to get involved this afternoon. Andre worries, making him get a little closer. He gets within two and a half lengths up the backstretch. 48 and three-fifths. Gray invasion with the lead from William Winsome. The Big Gray's committed to the Overland route. Racing with him are both Operative and Interstate, and Curlin's Knight now relegated to the rear, and Gray Invasion has the lead from William Winsome. Here's the Big Gray. That big circling move. Now the Big Gray got put into action early. He's making his move. The Big Gray and Gray Invasion. In third is Interstate, then with Operative. The Big Gray wasted no time this afternoon. He made an early move up the backstretch. Not the case recently, and today he's opening up with ease. It's the Big Gray near the eighth pole. Interstate fires into second. Gray Invasion is back to third. Here is the Big Gray, a dominating winner this afternoon. Nice ride by Andre Worry. Give the Wolverine back-to-back -back scores. Interstate second and Gray Invasion in operative. Cents, that's seven one double, nine dollars ten cents. That's an Andre the Giant double. Five seven one pick three, twenty three dollars sixty two cents. And there they go. Towards the tail of the field is Count on Friends. My Maggie with a quick start. Midnight Mindset's going with her. Winnipeg Wonder comes away running in third. Fourth place is held by Boom Kitty Bye Bye. Now Harry Hernandez is guided as you were to the far outside. She's in the clear and she's five lengths off the pace. The distant trailer is Count on Friends. My Maggie has a narrow lead for Midnight Mindset, her pace partner. Better than three lengths, Winnipeg Wonder, a length in front of As You Were with her wide charge. In the fifth spot is Boom Kitty Bye Bye and nothing yet from Count On Friends. And My Maggie has the lead, skipping Claire. Two length advantage midway through the turn for Midnight Mindset. My Maggie, Midnight Mindset wants to get off the rail. Now she cuts back into the margin. My Maggie almost a length. Midnight Mindset is second. Winnipeg Wonder is third, as you were is fourth. My Maggie off the turn, the one to come and catch. Opening up, My Maggie slapping six lengths on her rivals. And that's My Maggie who's all alone. And second is Midnight Mindset, farther back Winnipeg Wonder. And as you were, wake up, Maggie. I think I got something to say to you. You're headed to the winner's circle. My Maggie in front. From Winnipeg Wonder, Midnight Mindset. One seven double, seven dollars seventy cents. Seven one seven pick three, pretty formful, five dollars forty cents. Bet's race starts off. And there they go. Silent Invasion and Tivoli Garden show pace with a wish for Trish. Also there, Bad Breath. Midmon's up close, so too is Tina Burner from the outside. Insufficient notice advances from the rail. Racing Queen mid-pack with the Black Silks, five lengths off the lead. Two and a half lengths to Subtle Giant. Then we'll go to Alara, my little one, and nothing at the back from Princess in Paradise. On the front end, Tivoli Garden. She's quicker than a wish for Trish. In the fourth, in the third spot is Silent Invasion, and Silent Invasion's trying to close. She's under a little bit of a ride. Here's Midmon up the inside. Midmon's advancing very nicely. So Tivoli Gardens is the leader from Midmon. Silent Invasion. A wish for Trish is back to fourth. Bad Breath has the fifth spot. Then Racing Queen Tina Burner. Insufficient notice headed by Subtle Giant. Then we'll go to Alara. Farther back in the field, Princess in Paradise. And my little one in Tivoli Gardens still has the lead at the eighth pole under left-handed urging. To the outside comes Bad Breath. Bad Breath's closing in the center of the track. Tivoli Gardens, Bad Breath to the outside. Here comes Bad Breath to tackle Tivoli Gardens. And it's going to be very tough. Tight. What a finish between Tivoli Gardens and Bad Breath. And that exact to $100. The trifecta $144.75. The dollar superfecta $1,072. 7 8 double $40.20. 178 pick three $21. And there they go. Might as well run away a little awkwardly. A Big George's Kingdom begins the best. His pace partner. Is K and G. Trisatum's third with Night Spot. Might as well run. Recovers into the fifth spot. Then we're going to Starship Gotham. And Octu Lieber is the last of all. And Big George's Kingdom is making the pace better than a length and a half from K and G. In the third position is Trisatum. Might as well runs fourth from the inside. Night Spot's three deep through the clubhouse turn. Then we're going to Starship Gotham. And Octu Lieber is the last of all. And he's a little less than eight lengths off the pace. 24 and two-fifths for the favorite Big George's Kingdom. 
And he's under restraint. KNG's getting closer. They're trying to slow it down up front. Break of two and a half to try Satum. Night spots in the clear from the outside. Might as well run. Bides his time fifth from the rail. A little more than four lengths off the lead. As Big George's Kingdom has the lead all to himself. Now joining might as well run is Starship Gotham. Nothing yet from Octu Lieber, 48 and 4. And even flow for Big George's Kingdom. And he opens up with these. Here's Night Spot with a nice run into second. And Starship Gotham makes his move into third. Nothing yet from Might As Well Run, so it's all Big George's Kingdom. Night Spot gets closer from the outside. Big George's Kingdom confidently handled. Night Spot's out running his odds to the quarter pole. Big George's Kingdom still with the lead. Night Spot's under left-handed urging. Big George's Kingdom confidently handled at the eighth pole, but he's got a race on his hands. Here's Night Spot to the outside. Big George's Kingdom. Night Spot's testing him. Night Spot's making his moves. He's getting a push on by. Here's Night Spot to the outside. Night Spot in the upset from Big George's Kingdom. Might as well run. And fourth place to war. Long story short. Emmanuel Di Diego, New Jockey 6, impressed the professor. Seventh race starts a late pick three. And there they go. Swift start, gone and forgotten. You guys are no fun. Comes away and last. Now Clifton Punch is picking it up from She's a Lumberjane. Gone and forgotten. Broke the best, but she's going to sit a trip from third. Go to Dancing Slippers. You guys are no fun. And impress the professor. Is the last of all. Clifton Punch on the lead from She's a Lumberjane. Gone and forgotten third. Dancing Slippers fourth against the fence. Here's the favorite. You guys are no fun. Little less than five lengths off the pace through the clubhouse turn. Almost five lengths to impress the professor. So they enter the backstretch run. And on the front end, Clifton Punch. Kept honest by She's a Lumberjane. Almost a length advantage. Break of three lengths, two gone and forgotten. Dancing slippers, another length. You guys are no fun in the clear from the far outside. Almost five lengths to impress the professor. 24 and two-fifths, 49 and two-fifths. Pretty soft interior fractions. Clifton Punch, she's a lumberjane. Gone and forgotten makes her move three wide, and there she goes with a big blitz. Gone and forgotten with a big turn of foot. Closing in after the leaders, and here's you guys are no fun, 40. In fifth is Dancing Slippers. Impress the professors at the back. Clifton Punch is still fighting. Gone and forgotten makes her move. Here's you guys are no fun. Dancing Slippers is going to try to sneak on through a tight spot along the rail. Can she get on through? Now she looks like she's in the two path. In the meantime, you guys are no fun. Up to Gone and Forgotten. And the race is on past the 316s. Gone and Forgotten looking to become the fourth five-time winner of the season is determined. You guys are no fun is second. Gone and Forgotten. Double for Luis Perez. A triple for Michael S. Ferraro. It's a nice filly, gone and forgotten, out finishing. And there they go. Sweet Chalets is showing good speed. Pendolino is up close, so too is the favorite Queen Arella. There's Mind of Gold in the fourth position. Trivia comes away running in fifth. Fair Lassie is the last of all. Sweet Shallots has the lead. From between gals is the heavy favorite, Queen Arella. And Pendolino's forwardly positioned in the clear from the outside. Mind of Gold is three lengths off the pace, riding the rail currently in fourth. Two and a half clear of Trivia. It's another three lengths back to Fair Lassie. They race to the 3-8. Sweet Shallots still with the lead, a tight length. Queen Arella's just sitting on deck. Waiting on deck is Queen Arella inching closer. Pendolino races in third. She's two lengths from the front. Trivia's beginning her move, now four lengths off the lead, advancing outside of Mind of Gold. At the back is Fair Lassie, and Queen Arella has come away with the lead. Pendolino makes a move for second. Sweet Shallots begins the retreat. Then we're going to Mind of Gold. It's Queen Arella at the lead, past the eighth pole. Pendolino's going to test her inside the final 16th. Queen Arella shaking up. Pendolino trying to get her on the money. Queen Arella and Pendolino. Queen Arella, four in a row. She had to earn it. Pendolino tested her. Super $65.50. Seven, four, double, $13.20. Five, seven, four, nightcap. And there they go. 
No lime away a little slowly. Casper Joe walks out of the starting gate with the lead. From the rail is Goldmine Kaz. Now No Lime is trying to make up ground. He's out there very deep. Also there who is Jarrett from his inside. Blue Skies Forever's in no man's land. Take the edge of saving ground. Back to the front end. Goldmine Kaz confronted by No Lime. Casper Joe was third. In the fourth spot races who is Jarrett. Blue Skies Forever is fifth. Then take the edge. Just got hitched. Comes away running in seventh. Duck Pond Road is eighth. And Blizz is the last of all. 24 and three fifths. Goldmine Kaz and Rudy Ignacio, three parts of a length to No Lime and Ray Lou Gutierrez. Casper Joe vying for third with who is Jarrett. Three clear of Blue Skies Forever. Just got hitched, is making up ground. He's in the two path. Red Silks, Yellow Cap getting within five lengths, advancing from between runners. Take the edges along the rail. Duck Pond Road is second last and nothing yet from Blizz. No Lime and Goldmine Kaz. In third, who is Jarrett? Now Just Got Hitched is lurking like Pat Placido on the money line. And here comes Just Got Hitched, ready to tackle the leaders. In the meantime, who is Jarrett's up to the front from No Lime? Just Got Hitched is in with a chance, and so too is Casper Joe. And they turn for home. Who is Jarrett? Just Got Hitched makes his move in the clear. Casper Joe tries to muscle his way from between runners. And Duck Pond Road's trying to quick in. Here's Duck Pond Road. The tackle just got hitched. Duck Pond Road just got hitched from between runners. It's Duck Pond Road. Duck Pond Road and just got hitched. Duck Pond Road. Duck Pond Road in the nightcap. 4-2 late double, $22. 7-4-2 late pick, three $20.12. Late pick four combination, $798.75. Five out of five in the pick five, six thousand five hundred sixty-eight dollars fifty cents. Five out of six in the pick six was about a hundred and eighteen dollars. So we will have a pick six carry over into closing day. Two thousand two hundred seventy dollars and eighty cents. Two thousand two hundred seventy dollars and eighty cents. Our closing day pick six carryover. One hundred eighteen dollars and ten cents. For five out of six. One more day to go. 1230 first post. Sure hope you had a great Tuesday when leaving the track. Please drive very carefully. This has been racing from Finger Lakes Gaming and Racetrack. Good night, everyone.